All right, so if you have a backwards seat belt buckle, um, I'm gonna see if I can show you how to fix this. This is on a car seat, okay? So the same thing would apply for if you have this latch backwards or like on a regular car seat belt, okay? Because I've seen somewhere people's seat belts, like these kinds of things are reversed. So let me show you how you can fix that, okay? So what you do is you look at the bottom here, the seat belt goes in, the buckle actually goes in this way, okay? So what you can do is you can pull this out, and then what you do is you make it to like this. You fold it like that, and that way when you pull it back up, it will flip around. So I'm gonna pull the seat belt back through while I'm holding it like this. I don't know if I can do that with one hand. I'll kind of shove half of it through. You can see here that the folded part is going up, okay? I'm gonna have to grab this with my other hand, but there we go. Okay, so you can see the folded parts going up. So you pull that all the way through, and now that the folded part went all the way through, it flips over, okay? So the same thing would happen with this. If this is reversed, okay, what you do is you fold this. Again, same thing, you fold it like this triangle. It's hard to do this with one hand. Let me see if I can put my phone in a way that it, you guys can see. Okay, maybe this will, will this work? Okay, here we go. So let's say you have the thing is backwards. You fold this to make kind of like a triangle, okay, like that. And then when you get the pinched, the folded over part through, just like this, you can see it will go through to the other side. And now you can see it's actually flipped, okay? So now it's backwards because if you try and put this buckle in, you see it's facing backwards. Okay, so we gotta fix that, same thing. Fold it like this, okay? Once you have it folded like that, again, you can pass this through. Assuming the hole here is wide enough, you can get the entire thing through like that. Once you get one corner through, the rest is pretty easy. Just slide it down, and there we go, it flips over, okay? Very simple. Same thing would apply to this. Again, this one is a bit more, diff uh, a little bit, it would be a little bit more difficult because there's less room to go here and also it goes around. But again, you just fold it. Oops, let me see if I can show this. So you fold it like this, so you have a crease in it. Pass the folded part through, okay? You get the idea. So the folded part is gonna go through here, okay? And basically same thing. It's gonna go through and that will flip it over to the other side. I don't wanna do that because with trying to record it, it's a bit more difficult. But same thing, you would just pass the folded triangle part all the way through both sides. And that's pretty much it. Hopefully that helped you guys. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one.